everyone. I'm Emily and I work in the Children's Department at the Defiance Public Library. Today I'm going to share with you some of our new books that are available for you to check out. The Nutcracker and the Mouse King, illustrated and adapted by Natalie Anderson. This classic story by E.T.A. Hoffman is adapted into a colorful graphic novel. Out of all the Christmas gifts under the tree, Marie Stalbum is drawn to a nutcracker. His eyes are kind, his cheeks are red, and he has a friendly appearance. As midnight approaches, something magical happens. The nutcracker comes to life, and Marie experiences a fairy tale world full of fierce battles, a wicked queen, and an old curse that can only be broken by a true friend. To help her beloved nutcracker, Marie will have to face the evil mouse king and find the strength to stand up for her nutcracker, no matter the cost. Happy Narwhal Days by Ben Clanton. Join Narwhal and Jelly as they get into the holiday spirit. Narwhal is excited because the Merry Mermercorn is coming, part mermaid, part unicorn, and spreads cheer and awesomeness wherever she goes. And sometimes she may even leave a gift. Jelly is not so sure that the Myrmicorn even exists. Jelly finds a gift, and it's for Jelly. Jelly has new mittens to stay warm. Jelly is positive it must be from Norwal, so Jelly goes out in search of the perfect present for Norwal. Jelly finds out the mittens weren't a gift from Norwal. Could they have been a gift from the Myrmicorn? Does Jelly find the perfect gift for Norwal? Read Happy Narwhala Days by Ben Clanton to decide for yourself. Class Act by Jerry Craft. Drew Ellis is an eighth grader at Riverdale Academy Day School with his two friends, Jordan Banks and Liam Landers. Like all friends, Drew and Jordan have shared interests, but also their differences. Drew and Jordan are both African American, but each of them face different struggles related to their race. Jordan is an aspiring artist who wishes to attend art school. Drew is a great basketball player, but worries he'll become a stereotype if he joins the school's basketball team. Riverdale Academy Day School student population is predominantly made up of white upper class students. The faculty at Riverdale Academy Day realize that they need to work on diversity, equality, and inclusion. However, their chosen leader causes more issues among the students rather than helping them. To see how Drew, Jordan, and Liam navigate 8th grade and all the challenges thrown their way, read Class Act by Jerry Craft. <laughs>